The following are demonstrations of the Qualcomm Snapdragon concept vehicle on the floor at Mobile World Congress 2018. As you'll see, Qualcomm is inventing where connected cars go next. The QNX Hypervisor solution is a multi-domain controller that can run two operating systems on one Snapdragon 820 processor. The cluster is running QNX and the IVI center console is running Android. Cameras have replaced the vehicle's side view mirrors and display their view on the cluster. Four additional cameras placed around the vehicle are designed to allow for a surround view that's generated in real time on the center console. This one system on a chip is powering six cameras and two operating systems while maintaining a high frame rate on the cluster. In addition to the hypervisor solution are the vehicle's front passenger and rear passenger displays. The front passenger display is meant for the passenger as a co-pilot, with controls for 3D maps and navigation, alongside media controls for radio stations and video entertainment. Content can be sent to the rear passenger displays from the front, and passengers in the rear can take control of their own media. Echo cancellation allows the infotainment system to hear voice commands over loud ambient noise. Hey Snapdragon, what's the weather in San Diego? Right now in San Diego, it's 49 degrees Fahrenheit. Enjoy high-speed connectivity with the SDX50 5G modem. Download a movie or software update at amazing 5G speeds. With up to 5 gigabits per second of throughput, users can download a 15 gigabyte file in a matter of seconds. CV2X enables vehicles to communicate with other vehicles on the road, as well as road infrastructure. Using the module mounted on the roof, this vehicle can connect with infrastructure like stoplights, allowing it to view timing for green lights and receive warnings for pedestrians at the crosswalk.